What's going on y'all, Connor here. In this video, I'm gonna share step-by-step -step how I used a few AI tools to easily generate and publish a series of podcast episodes. All it took was an idea, a 30 second recording of my voice to create a clone, and I did all this only spending $1. The name of the podcast is Artificial Insights, and it explores how AI will be impacting our society in the upcoming years. If you'd like to check it out, I'll link to it in the description. The coolest thing that I learned from this experiment is that with AI-generated podcasts, we transcend the limitations of generic content and step into a realm of personalized knowledge acquisition. These digital marvels adapt to your unique interests, presenting you with information that truly captivates your mind and sparks curiosity. That was a clip from the podcast that I generated. I wanted to learn about how AI might be impacting the podcasting space in the upcoming years, but there's currently no content on that. There's currently no books on that. So I used AI to generate an eight minute episode that explores the different avenues, paths, and ideas of what that might look like. Now I feel like I have a pretty good understanding of where this might be going. And that right there is the magic of AI generated podcast. It gives you the opportunity to generate an optimal curriculum or content of whatever you wanna learn about or of whatever might help you out most based on what you're currently going through in life as an individual. I would highly recommend you try generating your own AI podcast at the very least as an experiment because this is a new frontier and here we are at the forefront. I'm going to show you how you can generate scripts for your episodes and then clone your voice using a 30 second audio recording. Then we'll use AI to edit the audio. And of course, we'll be publishing this to our favorite streaming platforms as well. If you like this type of content, be sure to go ahead and subscribe. Let's get started. The first thing we'll do is we'll use ChatGPT to turn our simple or complex idea into a full script for our podcast episode. Now, surprisingly, this was actually the most difficult part of the whole process for me, uh, just crafting prompts that could generate consistent results. As you probably know with ChatGPT, if you don't give it very precise instructions, it can ramble off into any direction. So this first prompt says, please expand on this idea and write a brief paragraph in the form of a premise. And the idea of this podcast episode we're creating right now is the AI revolution will create incredible economic opportunity. So that's what the podcast episode will be based on. And by the way, all of the prompts that I use in this video, you can find on a post that I posted um, on my newsletter. And I'll link to that in the description of this video. That way you can just copy and paste all the prompts over to chat GPT. And the response starts with, in a world propelled by the AI revolution, boundless economic opportunities await those who embrace the transformative power of artificial intelligence. And obviously you can respond to chat GPT and tell it to, um, rewrite the text output. You can tell it to be more humorous, more intellectual, include more facts, whatever you'd like. But for the sake of the video, I'm just gonna stick with this premise right here. And then the next step is we'll create three segment ideas for our podcast episode. So this next prompt says, please write three podcast segment ideas for an episode based on this premise. And then we're just gonna copy and paste the premise and press enter. And as you can see, ChatGPT is coming up with uh, three segment ideas. And the reason why we need segments is because ChatGPT does have a text output limit of around 4,000 characters, which comes out to around 500 words. I think that's around five minutes of audio. So if you would like a longer episode uh, that's longer than five minutes, you will need to create various segments and have ChatGPT create a script for each segment. Okay, now that we have the premise and the segment ideas, we're gonna go ahead and generate the full script. And I would recommend opening up a Word document to craft your prompt because it is a bit of a long prompt. And again, you can find this prompt on the post in my newsletter. And the beginning of it says, act as a podcast script writer. The scripts you create are fun, have a touch of humor, and are in the style of Tim Ferriss and Joe Rogan. The name of the podcast is Artificial Insights and is hosted by Atlas, who aims to educate average people on the topic of artificial intelligence. Obviously, you can edit this prompt however you like. You can add in uh, the style of whoever you would like the script uh, uh, to be formed on, and you can change the name of the podcast and everything like that. And then we're just going to copy and paste our premise below the context over here. Then we're gonna do the same for the segment ideas as well. Now just add in section one, two, and three before each of the segment ideas. And then I would recommend 
um, opening up a new chat window in ChatGPT, and then just copy and paste the prompt over. Press enter, and there we go. Um, here's our intro. And as you can tell, uh, ChatGPT is asking us for permission to proceed uh, before writing the next segment. And it's really important that you do it this way if you want to have a longer podcast episode, because again, uh, if you don't break it up into segments, ChatGPT will try condensing the entire podcast episode into a very um, condensed and short script. And you aren't going to get the fully formed thoughts and ideas if it's really condensed. So this is a workaround to, um, to create the full script that has fully formed ideas and thoughts. And there we go. We have our full script for our podcast episode. If you would like to generate titles for the episode, now would be a good time. You can simply just ask ChatGPT to come up with uh, various title ideas for the script that it just wrote. And now let's go move on to the fun part. Let's clone our voice and generate the audio. This is Eleven Labs by OpenAI. It's the voice generator that I use to uh, generate the audio for my podcast. And there's a few alternatives out there as well. I'll put some links in the description for those. And as you can tell, uh, you can use Eleven Labs for free. Uh, you can get 10,000 characters per month. The one that I chose was the starter plan. Uh, first month is 80% off. That's the $1 that I spent. And what you get with the starter plan is a commercial license. So you can actually monetize this if you'd like. Uh, you get 30,000 characters per month and the ability to um, clone your voice instantly. And you can just click subscribe. And as you can tell, uh, we got 40,000 characters right there. Um, that includes 10,000 free characters that they added on. And now we're just going to click on Voice Lab, Add Generative or Clone Voice. And if you'd like to clone your voice, uh, that's what I'm going to show you how to do now. However, they do have a voice library of various voices from actors that, that you can use if you'd like. Um, I think it's pretty cool, though, to clone your voice. And all I did was just talk into the microphone for about 45 seconds uh, to create a clip. And you just wanna upload that audio file right there. And then a description for this voice. I don't know if the description actually affects how the voice is generated or not. Um, however, it looks like it could help to describe uh, the person who is talking. So uh, my description is a 30 year old American man. Add voice. And there we go. Now we can go and add in our text and uh, create the audio. All right, let's go and generate the audio. So I'm just gonna start by copying and pasting the intro into the text box over here. And I'm gonna do that for the first segment as well. The maximum amount of characters for each generated audio file is 5,000 characters. So we will have to generate a few different audio files. Then just click generate. And here's a brief sample of the audio that we just generated now. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Artificial Insights. I'm your host, Atlas. It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty amazing that they're able to uh, clone a voice from such a short audio recording. It's kind of creepy, but it's also pretty cool. And we're just gonna continue doing this for uh, the second segment, the third segment, and the outro as well. And in the end, I have three different audio files here. Now we're gonna use an AI audio editor to tie all these together. Then we'll publish it to Spotify. All right, and this is Descript right here. It's an AI powered audio and video editor. Uh, they have a freemium plan, so you can use it for free. And honestly, you can use whichever audio editor you would like. I've just been in the habit of using Descript lately, so that's why I'm using it right now. And we're just gonna start by dragging our first audio file into Descript, and it creates a transcript, which this is really helpful if you actually uh, spoke into the microphone and created audio that way. However, it's not as relevant whenever uh, we just turned a script into audio. And we're gonna do this for the second and third file as well. Now, one of the cool things about Descript is you can actually edit the audio by editing the text. So you can select different words and do overdubs and all sorts of cool stuff. But again, it's not really that relevant because we just generated the audio using AI. So it's already really clean audio to start with. So we don't really need to edit it. We're just gonna go ahead and actually export it over here in the upper right-hand corner. It's gonna click Publish, Export, and then 
export again, save the file. And just like that, we have a full audio file of our entire podcast episode. Now let's go ahead and upload this to Spotify. That way we can publish it to various streaming platforms. You can really use whichever podcast hosting service you'd like. There's a ton of them out there. The reason why I went with Spotify is because it's free and it allows you to publish to all the streaming platforms. So uh, you just want to go to podcasters.spotify.com, click get started, and then I want to start a podcast and create your account. Once you have your account created, you just want to uh, click new episode. And from here, just drag over your audio file and upload it that way. Then you can create the title for your ep- for your episode and the episode description as well. And then you can obviously um, upload art for your episode or whatever you'd like. And whenever you're ready, just click publish now. If you'd like for your podcast to be available on other streaming platforms as well, um, you can just click on settings in the upper right hand corner, then click podcast availability. And from here, you can add in the uh, link URLs to your other um, podcast service account. So for example, if you want your podcast to be available on Amazon Music, you can create an account over there and they'll provide you with a URL to your account. Then you can just come over here, paste in your Amazon Music URL. And just like that, your podcast will now be available on that streaming platform. And you can obviously do that for the rest of these as well, such as Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, iHeartRadio, and so forth. And just like that, you've used AI to generate a full podcast episode and publish it to various streaming platforms. I really hope y'all learned a lot from this video and I hope it inspired y'all to go create something great. Please let me know in the comments if you create a podcast. I'd definitely like to check it out. Well, that's all for now. If you got value out of the video, go ahead and like it. If you haven't already subscribed, do that now and stay inspired, my friends.